Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're doing a two early best bets for UFC Apex this weekend. Uh, Edson Barboza, Lerone Murphy. This is again a two early one. What I mean by that is I can't do any, uh, it's just money line picks. Later in the week, hopefully by Wednesday or Thursday, hopefully Wednesday by the latest, I'll be able to do uh, better picks with underdog fantasy it is not even out yet i can't do anything with that it is the there's no bets there's no picks at all FanDuel has the money line at least out right now and again we will do another video as the days go on this will be out tonight sunday the 12th probably about eight o'clock but either way without wasting time before we get into that, subscribe, like, comment. I'm over 2,000 subscribers. Thank you guys so much. You're absolutely incredible. The community that we have been able to beat, even though I haven't been able to do as much live streams or videos that I've wanted to do because of work, you know, it sucks. But until I can do this full time, which hopefully one day I can do, that is the ultimate dream. But again, I'm here whether that happens or not. That It's just more content or just continue doing what I'm doing as I'm doing right now. So Either way, I will still be here. It's just more or less. You know what I mean? So, again, here we go. First fight is uh, Pierre Rodriguez Arian Carnalosi. That that first name is wild. But Carnalosi is a plus 136. I think Pierre Rodriguez wins. She's a minus 174. Again, like I said, I can't do any extra. It's just money line bets. Next is Vanessa Demopoulos versus Emily uh, Ducote. I think Dakota wins. She's a minus 330 favorite. I think that's a little bit too rich. Um, but if you double it, it puts it at a plus 105 on a parlay. So that's not terrible. Money line, there's definitely going to be some other ones like uh, significant strikes, you know, things like that on Underdog Fantasy, which I do like using Underdog Fantasy, especially for uh, significant strikes. I don't think Demopolis is going to be able to hold her down for three rounds. That's just not in the cards. So she's going to get some significant strikes. Uh, FanDuel doesn't necessarily have that. So it is what it is. Next is M uh, Melissa Gatto, Tamir's Vidal. I don't think Vidal is going to be able to hit that one shot on Gatto. I think Gatto wins. But again, she's a minus 430. Money line is what it is. Those three fights put you at one, plus 152. It sucks to be at such high odds. Because four to one is a little nuts, especially for uh, uh, three to one for Dakota and Demopolis, four to one for Gatto, Vidal. That's a little nuts to me, but that's what we're working with money line. That's why this is a early betting video. Next is Victor Mar Martinez versus Tom Nolan. Again, Tom Nolan's a minus four, uh, four forty. Victor Marino's Mar Martinez was finished by uh, Jordan Levitt. And if you're finished by Jordan Levitt, you are bad. Tom Nolan, minus 440. There you go. Abu Magomedov versus Worley Alves. Worley Alves, at the end of his career, he if he loses, this, probably retires. At the very least, is cut from the UFC. Abu Magomedov, minus 280. I'm good with that. Now, five leg parlay, plus 321. Not bad at all. Themba Garbino, Garimbo, sorry, Thumba Garimbo versus Ramiz Bra Brahima, Brahima, uh, plus 172 for Ramiz. I actually think Ramiz wins this fight. I think it's a little bit of a weird one because Ramiz hasn't fought in, I think, two years. Um, I like him coming back, and I like, I think Garimbo is good, but I think Ramiz being that good uh, grappler, good wrestler, makes this a dog fight, and I think he wins that matchup. And then Luana Pinheiro versus Angela Hill. I like Angela Hill. I think she's better every single spot in this except for knockout power. I like Angela Hill. Angela Hill never been knocked out. Angela Hill for the win. Adrian Giannis versus Vincius Salvador. Adrian Giannis is a minus 390. Sucks for that. It's that high. But again, parlay. I'll take that. Omar Sai versus Antonio Ciccoli, who uh, tested positive for PDs, has been out since 2021. So, Omar Sai, minus 290 for the win. This fight is not going the dis distance. That's going to be a good bet there. Uh, KS Williams, Carl, uh, Carlston Harris, uh, da, 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 minus 136 to plus 106. I think Carlston Harris wins that fight. We are missing some uh, fights here, I see. There's nothing I can do because they're not out yet. That's why it's an early betting prediction. Edson Barboza, Laurent Murphy. 
I think Edson Barboza at plus 126 is absolutely the bet there. I like Laurel Murphy a lot. Barboza's faster and I think has more power and he's very good at takedown defense. I think the things that Murphy is good at, fighting different fighters, uh, he's not going to be able to do with uh, Barboza unless Barboza gets caught early. Because Sadiq Yusuf caught him early. Shane Burgos was having success early. Uh, 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 you, you know, fighters have had success early. So that's the chance for Lone Murphy. But betting wise, Edson Raposa, 11 leg parlay, I believe, are still missing a fight or two. Uh, plus 14, 6, 17 odds. Again, go recap Pierre, Emily, Melissa, Tom, Abu, Ramiz. Angela Hill, Adrian Yanez, Omar, Omar Sai, Carlson Harris, and Edson Barboza. Uh, th- three underdogs, all the rest favorites. Those are my picks. You throw a ten dollar on there, you can win some good money. Put a, you put five, seven thirty. Some very very good bets. Shit, you put a dollar, you win one hundred and forty six. Some really good bets there. Mix and match them. Do what you have, what I have to do with them. Again, another betting video out later in the week. As always, guys, subscribe, like, comment. I'll see you at the next one. Peace.